Welcome back to the Tulloch Clan channel. It is Mark Tulloch and I am here with you for day 11. Day 11 of this body transformation. So the weight's coming off. The weight is coming off. Um, but today what we're talking about is training. Okay, training. We're going to recap training as it stands to this point and then we're going to tab a few awesome things on okay that is the plan for today the program team is the program okay so a program fully loaded up 10,000 steps plus so walking is the foundation of our program we're doing a lot of walking right okay Hindu push-ups if you need all any of the demonstrations for these exercises, go down into the description. I've time-coded everything. Well, I haven't, but in my mind, I know I'm going to time-code absolutely everything about this 28 days, so go down there and check it out. Squats. Perfect squats, perfect crunches. Okay, side lunge, which I've since discovered is called the Cossack squat okay the cossack squat supposedly hanging for seven minutes continuous okay so we need to get a chin up bar there's a video showing you exactly how to do it check the description and we're getting our active exercise to active rest ratio sorted okay we build that up slowly over time um Starting, it can be anywhere from two to three times a week, you're doing active exercise, which is strenuous exercise, and active rest on the other days, which is yoga, stretching, walking, doing whatever at home, sauna, um, Wim Hof, different things that are good for your body that are not quite as strenuous as active exercise. Okay, so if you're not sure what that is, that doctrine, the active exercise versus active rest, new to the show go and have a look in the description i'll also put a link through to active exercise against active rest so that is what we are currently doing like seriously all of that okay obviously your walking takes a bit of time but i expect that you get quite a bit of that done in the day but the hindu push-up squats perfect crunches um, side lunches side lunges and hanging you could do all of that maximum 30 minutes and maximum 30 minutes we've built up to so far for the strength stuff. Obviously the walking could be anywhere from an hour. Okay, so there's a bit of bit of time in there. Bit of time involved, but get audible going. Get audible going and listening to your personal development stuff. Get cranking with that. Um, and get productive. What we're adding today to the proceedings is the Bulgarian, whether you want to call it, yeah, Bulgarian lunge. Okay, Bulgarian lunge. We'll put lunge in there. Bulgarian lunge. Alright. Bulgarian lunge. And the tricep dip. Okay, two sensational exercises. Both of them I like because they also add mobility to the body as we like. I think a lot of exercises do, but you'll see these do. This does require a little bit of equipment, sort of, technically. A bench, a seat of some sort. So get yourself sorted, get yourself a bench or a seat, and I'll see you very shortly. Right, first up we'll deal with the dip. The dippity doo the diposaurus rex, dip city. Um, I really enjoyed dips. I used to do a lot of dips as a uh, high school student, actually. I quite enjoyed dips back in the day. So maybe we'll get back into a round of dips. Dips, man. Alright, so we come in. This is how we like to hit the dips. Alright, main key point is, see my hips? I'm nice and tight into the bench. I'm not getting too far away, stretching out too far I'm keeping it nice and tight as I come down you'll see here my back is tied into the bench 
my hands, fingers facing forward, and you see behind me the stretch is through my chest. Okay, so that is how the rep should go. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good. Step it up. So we're going to add dips, dippity doodahs to the program. Uh, I like it because it really stretches out through the chest. Um, as you do it, it stretches through the shoulder at the bottom of the, at the bottom of this movement. Yeah. Okay, if you do them properly, they really stretch you out. Now, modified to make it easier. Feet up. Okay, you can make it slightly easier. Keep the back in quite a bit easier to the point where if you're shattered you know when you get people doing a lot of dips you can get them spotting through it like that is you can still provide a burn even when people are squatting off um, get a good burn in as people get fitter as you you get fitter the weight comes off your feet will start extending out to the full dip. Well done team, get 50 done. Next up we've got the Bulgarian lunge. Bulgarian lunge is brilliant because it divides the legs up between the left and the right. It's done individually, it stretches out the hips on the opposing side as you do the exercise. So it's a fantastic exercise in that way. I'm going to show you exactly how you do the Bulgarian lunge from a couple of angles. Okay, angle number one. You'll see that the key point is when I set up, I set up at shoulder width apart. And what I want to do is get right up onto my bench or my chair. I put a foot up and I'm putting the bottom of the ball of my foot right here the bottom of the ball of the foot, right in on the corner. Okay, feet shoulder width apart. From there I'm going to hop out. Okay, I'm still connected, I'm feeling a bit of a stretch, but I'm nice and tall, I'm upright, my feet are shoulder width apart. Okay, from there, I'm dropping down. Okay, I'm making sure that I keep my knee behind my toe and I stay nice and tall. Okay, I'm trying to get to parallel, so that first couple of reps, yeah, nice, feeling that, three, four, five, good. Okay, this is just sliding out on me a little bit, which probably means I'm a little bit too far forward and pushing back on it. It shouldn't slide. My balance should be such that that's okay, not sliding, but there we go, blocked off anyway. Okay, here we are. We've set up, feet shoulder width apart, nice and drop down. Good. So the restriction is really in the hip on the opposing side. I can get this leg strong enough to go deeper, but that, this hip, okay, I think I've, as I've discussed previous videos, it's jacked up, but this is helping to loosen it off. Woo! Good. Okay, that's the first set of the Bulgarian lunge, really opening up the hips as well. Side on angle of the Bulgarian lunge. Also known as the single leg lunge. Okay, so as I said, it's easier to go in nice and tight, foot on. Okay, when I see people doing this, amateur hour, okay? Amateur hour. We'll block this out. Go, that should stop it. 
Okay. Here we go. Burnt. Nice and tall. So I'm staying as tall as I can. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. So this is my strong leg. But jacked up leg. Here we go. This is my less strong leg, but not jacked up leg. Cool. So setting it up. So the restriction. Good. Deep into it, the stretch through this. Oh. Okay, the stretch in there through the right hand side is sensational. We're adding those two exercises in to our workout program the tricep dip and the split lunge. Okay, we're adding those in on top of everything that we're already doing. There's it, team. Keep up in the ante, keep working on it, you got this.